it, CM Punk was the was was the white whale. That was the first time he. That was his first public appearance. Yes. Since like, he had done nothing. He had done UFC. nothing. Yeah. And uh, I, know, I mean, I've known Punk for a long time. I don't. He's kind of w- easy to deal with and great guy. Great guy. Yeah. Great guy. I mean, I, I think he's probably the most misunderstood wrestler yes. we've ever dealt with. Uh, but I started pursuing him before Starcast too because I knew I wanted to go back to Chicago and I knew I wanted him. But we were just too far apart at first, and then uh, we would just be in constant contact, and then nothing, and then constant contact, and then nothing, and then out of the blue, I got a message from him that says, "Hey, are we doing this or not?" And at that point, I I had already decided we were definitely not, and I thought he had landed there too, but all of a sudden we became a little more agreeable, spoke very quickly, and I wanted him to be super super comfortable. You know, I didn't want him to feel like, "Hey, this is going to be um, anything less than super fun and super easy." And so we tried to do it as fun and easy for him as we could. And when it was over, he sent us the nicest message ever, saying it was the most easy and fun and well-run you know, experience he had had, which was like shocked the hell out of me and Dan. So we were happy with 